I have been told that I am addressing the gay boyfriend, so I figured it was appropriate in light of Donald Trump's son's re you know, references to Skittles that <laughs> I wanted to be the first one to say taste the rainbow to a gay guy, so therefore <laughs> I'm saying it. Because I'm not beyond using euphemisms and shit like that. <laughs> so, anyway, I understand that you think that you would be a superior candidate to Rob Noxious. With 49 years of experience and expert sarcasm and true love of the American people, because nobody else seems to give a shit about them, that you're going to be superior to that. I don't think so. Not at all. Yeah, as for your religious arguments, well, you know, we know what religion is. Religion is bullshit. Okay. Religion has us believing that there's an invisible man up in the sky and he's got ten things that you're not supposed to do and if you do them, he's got a place for you full of brimstone and terror and all this other horrible stuff. But he loves you. He loves you. And he needs money. All powerful, all great, all that. Somehow can't manage money. What the fuck is that shit? <laughs> so anything religious, forget it. Ain't gonna happen. Okay, because the only religion that's truly out there and the only thing that should be worshipped on all of this earth is Rob Noxious. Because of my expert sarcasm. 49 years in the making. So, what can you say to that?